Spiders, six, yeah, 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 The price I want for show you gon' need three promoters. I got the body from Jamelis, but I had switched the motor. I got these badass bitches running around this bitch, they all the coders. Yeah, I just told them make a story. Yeah. I just bought all the Trojans. Yeah, yeah. I told her stab my nicks. Yeah. I told her stop telling that thing she seen and told her meet me at the Ritz. Let's go. I got a guess in the back of my ring and I went in trying to hit. I told her she gotta run through the team before she can talk to the lit. Before she can talk to the yeah. yeah. Let me talk. I just pulled up with some fools. I told her mama tie all my shoes. Show her two million cash and she woozy. Twenty matches and I'm still snoozing. I had came up out the trenches then I had beat a few bodies like Goosey. She said you work on my show, you my coochie. I had to sing to this bitch like Lil Uzi. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bitch got a bad word on her nightstand. She must be fucking with Gunna. Yeah, yeah. I fuck with Slacks and we gonna eat racks and I came with some fucking piranhas. Yeah. Got a bitch, Scotty, I got in my world. Need somebody grow me a tree. Get my the hood in my truck, got a hood now. Pick up the car with no keys. Beat it. She for the street, need me. Only one she got hit at the street, need me. I feel a little rich this week. Them phones, my family, they're not me. Woo! I am back from the gym. It was a good, really good session. Today was legs. Legs is literally my favorite day. I mean, like, you just can never go wrong with legs. Like, I don't know. Legs just give me that extra oomph. I don't know. I, I do need to get stronger when it comes to upper body, though. But, you know, in the meantime, we're working on it. We're working on the upper body you know in due time hey you guys sorry to interrupt today's video however today's video is sponsored by families for families so huge thank you to families for families for sponsoring today's video if you guys aren't familiar with families for families well let me tell you a little bit more so families for families are a student-led initiative where young leaders take charge in making sure that fresh groceries and other essential items such as diapers, feminine care products are delivered to families in need in their community. The students are usually in charge of collecting the items, delivering the goods, and pretty much planning and having their own creative take on everything. But of course, Families for Families is here as backup and as a guide to get you to the right path in the right direction. They do suggest local nonprofit organizations to help you and pick up those groceries and shelters who are willing to help you with that. As you guys know, I am a junior here at Savannah State University, 
majoring in theater arts and my community is something that I take pride in as some of you may know I am in more than nine different organizations therefore community service and support for those in need is something that I truly value what I personally love the most about families for families is that they encourage and empower students to address food insecurities as well as make a positive change in their community they also do have college student clubs so if you're interested in starting a chapter at your school please feel free to reach out to families for families and also you can start this chapter at either your high school or your university I know my semester is almost over so I do plan on starting hopefully a chapter here at Savannah State so if you're interested in helping out in this huge nonprofit organization please make sure to reach out to me on Instagram so we can all come in together and do what's best for our community I truly love this opportunity and I'm super grateful for families for families this chapter is something that I'm working to launch next semester as you guys know we are at the end of this spring semester so in fall 2024 it will be something that I will be looking to launch and of course it'll be a work in progress in the summer until we're ready for launch in the fall and of course I will have families for families here to guide me once again if you guys are interested please feel free to reach out to families for families or you can even make donations if you're not someone who's able to help or you don't have the time to come out to your community and help you can still come in and donate to families for families of course all links and all info will be down below in the description box so make sure you guys go and check that out let's get back to the original video okay boom <laughs> welcome to another vlog this weekend is gonna be pretty much like a weekend in my life hbc edition just enjoy you know i don't really have it's a lot going on this weekend which is why i chose to vlog i'm not gonna kind of give you guys a rundown i'm gonna just let it flow see where it takes us i know i've been going for a while listen sometimes you just you gotta get it together up here okay you just gotta get it together so that's that not sure if you guys know but i did recently start my henna business if you guys are not following henna by shayla feel free to do so it's actually 12 30 right now i'm perfect on time my first client is at one then my second client is at two o'clock i have two clients today and i have blocked the rest of the day off just to kind of like get ready because tonight are probates we have our new greeks fraternities and sororities coming out tonight so i'm super excited and my homegirls coming out so excited for that deuce okay period so yeah let's go back home um, get ready for our clients and enjoy today's vlog y'all y'all okay the bra is looking a little thick today because i got them done yesterday y'all but it's currently 4 34 i'm currently getting ready doing my makeup i'm gonna do a little light beat foundation only to be honest my brows are already done i just put my lashes on favorite my favorite 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 foundation is this il maquillage my shade is woke up like this in 175 and it's so freaking good like i've been using this and it's super lightweight and i love it but nevertheless we're doing a quick get ready with me really quick i'm not doing too much I just really want to cover up my dark spots because I've really been breaking out. That's really the only reason why I'm applying makeup. I really wasn't even going to do makeup for real. The outfit that I have in mind is super cute. I bought this like skirt from Walmart yesterday or like two days ago. I thought it was so freaking cute so I chose to wear it today. I'll show you guys the whole OOTD once I get up and I'm fully dressed and stuff. But for right now, I'm just doing up this makeup girl because you know we want the makeup 
T on point, okay? But yeah, I just really wanted to look, really like catch y'all up. I know I've been MIA, like I haven't posted in like, I don't remember the last time I posted my video, neither do I remember what video it was. Unfortunately, I don't really have an excuse. I really just been getting myself together, trying out different hobbies and really figuring out what's next for me. In a sense, I've been, I've been doing YouTube since quarantine, so it's like, we're going on five years so it's been a really really long time coming so i'm just really discovering like new hobbies what's for me what's not for me letting go of certain things and just like you know getting myself together and just like getting together mentally physically emotionally all of the above um yeah if you know you know like you get what i'm saying sometimes like a lot of us content creators have to just like you know kind of go ghost a little bit i just i was in an era where i just didn't feel the need to post i didn't feel the need not the need but i just didn't feel the want to have somebody or like the internet know what's going on with my life so I was just kind of MIA but I was still posting on like Instagram but I'm not gonna lie I even took a break from that like I wasn't posting on Instagram as much or if I was posting it was like only on my story and I was like promoting my henna business because like I told y'all I did start doing henna and stuff so you know just like finding new hobbies new careers and just finding ways to be successful and continue to just you know elevate as a person as a woman and also getting closer to god i've been building my faith that's definitely one of my goals for this year and i am doing so well and i'm super excited about that um i got to sing at church for the first time a couple weeks ago and i get to sing again on sunday for easter so i'm really really excited i have my own mic and i'm really excited to really make that come together because getting close with God and like building my faith has been something that is super important to me. I mean, I wouldn't be here without him. So I'm really just looking forward to continuing to build that and just, you know, just continuing to spread the word and just like being the best person and influencer and, you know, image and just a better daughter, person, friend, just a better person overall. I just, I just have so many goals and dreams for the woman that I desire to be and I want her to be on top, you know? I'm back i had to change my battery they've been dying super fast i don't know if it's because i haven't used my batteries in so long but girl they've been dying very very fast so i had to just you know get them together real quick the makeup is looking cute so far i'm just probably gonna put like a little bit more and that's gonna be like really it yeah that's really where i've been for y'all like i really just been getting things done on my end really i'm really excited for the new type of content that i have coming up i probably am gonna switch it up just a tad not too much with this vlog this vlog is gonna be like an og type vlog but moving forward do expect different do expect you know me kind of stepping out of my comfort zone and just trying different things so just be ready for that i know i want to get into cinematic videos i'm very excited about that i'm also going to be doing more drone content because as y'all know i have a drone and i haven't been using it much and also i do plan on investing in a camcorder so i do want to vlog with that and just like you know i'm aiming for like a no makeup makeup look so that's literally all we're doing then we're gonna do bottom mascara of course because you can't forget them bottom lashes i do have to be there at five the probate doesn't start until seven but because i'm helping i call time at five o'clock cute and now we're gonna do our lips and we're gonna be literally done with makeup my favorite brand when it comes to pencils are my NYX pencils. This one is really about to be done. I do need to re-up, but this color is so pretty. Like, look at that. Look at that color. Now I'm gonna go in. Usually I just put gloss like this, but today I'm in a mood for my butter gloss. It's also from NYX, I believe. This is creme brulee. This is the shade that it's in. We're just gonna kind of fill in the middle a little bit. Uh, so that's the makeup for the day. Voila! I did tie my hair up. I did do my edges and everything like that. I'm gonna finish getting dressed and then I'm gonna come back with you guys with the final OOTD. So I'm back, y'all. This is the outfit. Super cute, super girly. It's giving, you know. I mean, it's giving switching it up. Y'all see how cute this outfit is? That is so cute. Like, in love, y'all. Yeah, period. So yeah, that's the OOTD. Hope y'all like it. Let's go to the probate and start working. And of course, I'm gonna be vlogging everything for y'all.
Put that on your head and make one of your partners some kill you. Yeah. Say fuckin' with me and you gotta grow up. This nigga got some shit. Yeah. This shit ain't get fed in my pocket. I got it like I hit the lottery. Yeah. This is literally the best flavor. I'm such a simple girly. If you like chocolate ice cream, you're a man in society. Sorry, not sorry. That cookies and cream stuff, like chocolate ice cream, dark, mm -mm. vanilla. Nice and sweet and simple, okay? Comment down below your favorite ice cream. Right now, I want to find something to wear. The product starts at 3. It's currently 3. What's supposed to work it? I'm tired. We went out last night, and I'm tired, okay? <laughs> Need a break. <laughs> I really don't know what I want to wear today. I really don't know what I want to give. I have this outfit that I wore a while ago. I could wear something like more chill. But I don't really know. This outfit is cute. I might wear that. I just might. And I already have this shirt on. So I'm just probably going to crop it and just make it cute. Yep. I got an outfit. Let me get ready. Figure out what the outfit wants to be. And then we'll take it from there. <laughs> Sorry, my camera was blurry, but we're all ready. I ended up wearing something else than what I originally had planned, but it still came out cute. I tried to put my hair in a ponytail. I hope I keep it like that for a little while because it's heavy, not gonna lie. I'm gonna put my rings on and then we're gonna be ready to go. <laughs> Look at the fit. Don't mind my badge, but yeah. You know, jersey, cute, baggy. That's the fit. <laughs> I'm just gonna quickly put my rings on I really be doing gold and silver and I don't know I just really be just doing whatever I want for real I'm probably gonna just wear one ring today this is the ring that I bought from James Avery a couple days ago it's like a gift to myself and I just think it's so freaking cute like I love it gold jewelry and silver rings is crazy work but Gotta do what you gotta do. So let me go to the car and go because my friend is about to come out. Yeah, I gotta go see him. <laughs> the bad lighting but i'm tearing up some noodles these are the best noodles the hot and spicy nissan brand baby and you take out all the juice because i don't like the juice in our noodles i don't like no juice in my noodles mm -hmm. these are so good i don't change my outfit because we're supposed to be going to take pictures so hopefully they come out good because i just put this outfit together so last week and i'm still trying to put it together so yeah hopefully we do get some content and stuff my friend is on the way now. He should be there anytime soon. But yeah. That's that. The probate was nice. The noobs did their thing. 
I'm so proud of my friends. Like, they crossed. So, so proud of them. So happy for them. It's 6.54, by the way. And, you know, 6.54 p.m. It's on parties tonight. To be completely honest with y'all, I don't really want to go party. So, I might not go outside. Or if I do, one, I'm not going to be out late. And two, I'm not going to drink. So, yeah. But, oh yeah, we'll see. My niggas in my red Mercedes Attitude like fuck you pay me Roll it deeper than a dead when we go out If the ladies show up and we show out With my girl in my red Mercedes Attitude like fuck me baby Let the seat so she wetter than a pool now When that thing go up then she go down This shit so clean I put that on So I am back in the car now I just left Ulta And I did do my henna yesterday I didn't get a chance to show y'all But I did do it yesterday And I still got these almond nails from before my me. but you know and i put a flower right here to connect it but i did like a skeleton hand and i did in red and i put that girl in a ray big right there hopefully i said that right but yeah just left Ulta. i did need a couple skincare products so i just you know stopped by and did that church was so good y'all like i got this thing today and i was super excited so it was nice but yeah let me just give y'all a quick haul so first thing i picked up is my vitamin c murray essential c cleanser i've been using this to cleanse my face for a couple months almost going on a year now and i absolutely love it it's super gentle on my skin this was the main thing that i needed to pick up from ulta today because i literally ran out like yesterday and i need this for my skin it's definitely my go-to when it comes to washing my face so i had to pick that up Next thing I picked up is my Cat P Bump Eraser Body Scrub. If you also have strawberry legs that you struggle with, I highly recommend this product. I make sure to always use this up to like two or three times a week. Not every day throughout the week, just like two or three times because it is like, you know, an exfoliator and it's really good and it's also good for sensitive skin. And then another product that I picked up is this fur oil. I've used this brand before. I use their fur oil, which is good for like, you know, bikini area after you shave, this, that, and the third. But I also decided to try this this ingrown eliminator serum today because you know just to see like just for it to treat my ingrowns and stuff like that so hopefully it works um i used the fur oil already so this should be pretty good and go hand in hand together so i'm excited to try this one out i really want to see what it looks like it said it's a serum on there so i'm just gonna pop it open because i really want to see like what does it look like Ugh, ripped it, but it's okay oh nice oh this is so cute Look at this packaging. That is so pretty. I'm so excited to use this even more. But yeah, that's the serum. And then the last item that I got is a new skincare product that I decided to try. Uh, I'm not going to say, well, I am going to say new because I literally recently just started using it. My mom had this like toner at home when I went back home to Miami and it was like a La Roche, La Roche Posay toner and I've seen a lot of people been using this type of skincare and it's been really good on their skin so I told her I was gonna take it and I did take it and it's been doing really good on my skin no breakouts or anything so I decided to go and pick up their double face repair moisturizer and here is it right here this is it right here that I decided to pick up you know something new because I do use a Neutrogena face repair moisturizer but I decided to go in and try theirs and hopefully it works really well on my skin because their toner has been working really good so that's what I got from Ulta, it's always good coming to Ulta. I love Ulta, I don't know. Ulta is a thing that can I can really come in here and just like spend a whole day and sit here and look at every skincare product, every new thing. Like I know where everything is at Ulta. That sounds freaking terrible, but yeah. I mean, I haven't came here in like a minute, so that's pretty good. Last time I sent my mom, so that don't count, right? <laughs> that doesn't count, right? But yeah, that's about it, y'all. I did want to get some makeup wipes as well because I am running out. But I seen that it was $7.99 for a makeup wipe. So I said, oh no, baby. I will go to Walmart and I'll get that from there instead. So when I go to Walmart sometime this week or this weekend, whenever I choose to go, I will pick that up. I didn't get to grocery shop this weekend because I was having issues with my car. So I actually just picked it up from the dealership. Not the dealership, the mechanic rather. Um, so I didn't really get a chance to do that. But hopefully I will do that. But hopefully I'll get to do that like throughout the week sometime. Um, yeah, that's when I'll do that. 
And then, but yeah, that's pretty much it, y'all. That's it, that's all. I'm gonna go on and close out today's video. I really, really hope you guys enjoyed. It was so nice picking up the camera again. Honestly, it was like a breath of fresh air that I really, really, really needed. So I'm really, really glad that I got to do this today and just pick up the camera and just vlog for y'all because we do have a lot of events coming up this week that I do intend to vlog. So I need to kind of get in the habit of picking up the camera again and just vlogging because I really do miss YouTube and just, you know, content creation and stuff like that. Even though I felt like God was kind of pulling me away for a little while and just kind of like you know telling me no and I was also telling myself no and getting in my head about things and also focusing on other things as well but you know that happens sometimes you kind of have to get pulled away from your career and what you love to kind of like find the true love and passion for it all over again so I'm not too mad about that I'm just glad that I'm back and I'm better and I'm really excited for you guys to see this video to see my face again because I've been getting so many DMs y'all been asking me where I've been at and I'm so excited for y'all to see okay yeah Shay's okay Shay's good Shay is doing okay Shay they just needed some time to just you know recuperate get herself together i do have a lot of exciting content coming up for y'all i'm so so excited for it um i ain't gonna say too much but you guys will see that you know these next couple months april is gonna be amazing today's also april 1st so happy april 1st i wish you guys a successful month a blessed month a holy month and everything above i really hope that you guys have a successful month and so many good things are on the way just keep praying and everything will be oh okay okay so that's all i wanted to say i love you guys so much thank you so much for all the support that i've been receiving it means the world to me i'm excited for the new content that i have coming up this month next month and for the rest of the year i know the beginning of this year on youtube hasn't been the best for me or the most consistent rather but it will be the best and i will end it off with a bang this year so i'm excited you know your girl is excited i'm back in them better back in them better so yeah let me home let me head on back on campus now that i got my big body bins back it's not a big body bins but you know in my head it is that's that's all that matters <laughs> i'm out of here i love y'all i'll see y'all the next one bye y'all peace